Game Digital plc is the parent company of Game Retail Limited, a British video game company that trades under the game brand, stylized as Game. The company's origins lie in the founding of the Rhino Group by Terry Norris and Bev Ripley in 1991. A number of mergers and acquisitions followed during the 1990s, and in 1999, the company was purchased by Electronics Boutique Limited, which rebranded itself as the Game Group. The company continued to expand during the 2000s, purchasing several retailers including GamesWizards in Australia. In March 2012, several suppliers, including Nintendo, Electronic Arts and Capcom refused to supply their latest products due to concerns over games' creditworthiness. Game subsequently entered administration on 26 March 2012, and was purchased by OpCapita the following week. Baker Acquisitions was subsequently renamed Game Retail Limited. The company operated in the United Kingdom under the Game and GameStation brands from the acquisition of the latter in May 2007 until the end of 2012, when it was announced that the business would focus solely on the game brand. Game Digital PLC reported a £10.4 million loss for the 12 month period from July 2016 to July 2017 in its full year results. In the corresponding 2015-2016 period, the company has had a net profit of £7.1 million. History Formation The company that went on to become Game was founded by Bev Ripley and Terry Norris as Rhino Group in 1992, with stores branded as Future Zone. A year earlier in 1990, a separate company, called Game, was founded by Peter Wickens and Neil Taylor. Rhino Group acquired Virgin Games stores from W. H. Smith in November 1993, increasing the total number of stores to 77. In October 1995, the gaming retailer Electronics Boutique acquired 25% of the Rhino Group, the name of which was changed to Electronics Boutique Limited under license from the business in America, and John Steinbrecher was sent from the United States to manage the chain. The name of the retail outlets were also renamed from Future Zone to Electronics Boutique In November 1999, Electronics Boutique Limited purchased a chain of retail outlets known as Game, from which the current name of the company was derived, for £99 million. At the time of the takeover Game had 86 stores. In October 2001, Electronics Boutique Limited went on to purchase the Barry's World online gaming service, the French retailer Scoregames, and the Spanish retailer Centro Mail. In 2002, Electronics Boutique stores in the United Kingdom and Ireland were rebranded as Game, and the company name was changed to the Game Group. Despite the name change, a 1% sales royalty to Electronics Boutique in the United States continued to be paid until January 2006. Attempts to have this overturned in court in February 2003 were unsuccessful. In July 2004, the Game Group acquired Gameplay GB Limited, an online and mail order retailer of video games, computer software and associated products. Gameplay GB Limited started trading as game.co.uk, the group's main online arm in the United Kingdom. In September 2006, Game acquired Australian speciality video games retailer GamesWizards for $3.8 million and rebranded all GamesWizards outlets as Game Stores. Under the ownership of Game, the company followed the aggressive growth strategy of its parent, and by 2007 had grown to 49 stores nationwide. The growth continued to 118 stores by 2009. Management changes in 2010 saw the number of stores reduced by 26. In May 2007, the company announced the acquisition of rival specialist video game chain GameStation for £74 million. The company stated that they intended to retain the brand. On 21 April 2010, Lisa Morgan stepped down as CEO, to be replaced by Chris Bell as interim CEO. On 17 June 2010, it was announced that Ian Shepard had been appointed as CEO, and took up the position on 28 June. Financial problems On 29 February 2012 it was announced that both Game and GameStation would no longer stock new titles from Electronic Arts. This was due to the major games distributor limiting games credit terms. 
This affected the pre-orders of Mass Effect 3, due out the following week. On 5 March 2012 it was announced that Game and GameStation stores would not be stocking titles by Capcom. The first title affected by the move was Street Fighter X Tekken. Customers who pre-ordered the special edition from either store were refunded. In early March 2012, Game and GameStation began heavily discounting stock in an attempt to bring in cash ahead of administration. On the 14th of March 2012, OpCapita made an unsuccessful bid for the company. The business had been in talks with games lenders with the aim of buying its debt and settling its bills with suppliers in full. The offer was rejected by games lenders. Microsoft and Activision ceased the supply of their products to game on 15 March. On 19 March, the company's shares were suspended from the London Stock Exchange at its own request. Administration The company entered administration on 26 March 2012, with PricewaterhouseCoopers appointed and Ian Shepard stepping down as CEO. No administrator was appointed for the stores in Ireland and redundancies were only offered to staff in the United Kingdom, resulting in a continuing protest from Irish staff. 277 of games 609 stores in the United Kingdom were closed immediately, resulting in 2,104 job losses. On 31 March 2012, Game Group was purchased out of administration by OpCapita. David Hamid was announced as the new executive chairman of Game. On 14 May 2012, TGW Thai Limited, trading as Game Australia, announced it would also enter administration. On 25 May 2012, PricewaterhouseCoopers, the administrators of Game Australia made 264 staff redundant and closed 60 stores. An expected further round of redundancies and closures was confirmed on 19 June 2012 when the administrators announced that 16 of the remaining 31 stores would close that day and the remaining 15 would close over the coming weeks, marking the end of Game Australia. Games Scandinavian operations were purchased by Nordic Games at the end of May 2012. Nordic Games purchased 55 stores 44 in Sweden and 11 in Norway and Games Scandinavian website, and also have a licensing deal that allows continued use of the game brand. <laughs> Public listing In May 2014, the company announced plans to relist on the London Stock Exchange. The initial public offering took place in June 2014. Topic: <inaudible> Operations. As of the 2nd of April 2013, Game has 328 stores in the United Kingdom. Stores traded under the Game and GameStation brands until the latter was replaced by Game from November 2012. Stores sell games for all major video game platforms. Games are also sold under a pre-owned label, where a customer has returned a used game for cash or credit. The company also operates a transactional website, game.co.uk. <laughs> Topic: See also. GameStop, GameStation, CEX, Christmas Shopper Simulator.